where ISRO has now announced that the Chandrayaan-3 satellite has already been assembled with the LVM-3 launch vehicle. It is now ready for launch on 13th of July. That's the big development. So the assembly of the satellite has already been done and it is all ready to be launched uh, on July 13th. Now, this was after the debacle of uh, Chandrayaan 2 uh, uh, that was an attempt to launch the Chandrayaan 2 satellite into, into the moon, into the pole of uh, the moon's orbit, uh, the moon's surface. That could not happen and uh, ISRO has tried once again where uh, now we are getting to know that the satellite is assembled and ready to be launched. H Harshit Gupta, Akshit Gupta on the telecast with me. Akshit, uh, give me details. This is good news coming in. Uh, July 13th is when the satellite is going to be launched. Uh, preparations already have been made. Uh, the satellite has been uh, now assembled. Uh, yeah, the Indian Space Research, Research Organization has integrated the payload fairing containing the Chandrayaan-3 uh, spacecraft with the uh, launch vehicle Mark 3. And uh, uh, the mating of the payload fairing with India's heaviest rocket was done at the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Arikota. And the Chandrayaan-3 mission is slated to launch uh, on July 13th to the moon as it looks to explore the geology of the only natural satellite of Earth. Uh, well, we are also knowing that this 3,900 kilograms spacecraft was first encapsulated in the payload, uh, fairing of the rocket at the uh, UR Rouse uh, satellite center and was then moved to be integrated aboard the rocket that will push it outside Earth's orbit, setting on a course to the moon nearly 384,000 kilometers away from the Earth. Uh, well, uh, uh, we are also knowing that uh, the period between July 12 to July 19 is optimal for launch. Uh, when the orbital dynamics will ensure minimum fuel and higher efficiency in the journey uh, to the moon. And the Indian Space Agency has also said that the lander would have the capability to soft land at a specific uh, five lunar site and deploy the rover, which will go on to platform uh, in situ chemical analysis uh, of the lunar surface during the course of its mobility. Back to you. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.